James Kaufman, World News Report Today. Today is July 7, 2023, 11.30 a.m. Central here in the U.S. God bless you and yours, no matter where you are in the world. Please subscribe, give us a thumbs up, ring that bell for critical future updates. A sunspot so big that NASA saw it from Mars. A huge sunspot, AR-3363, just emerged over the sun's southeastern limb. But the Mars rover Perseverance saw it before we did. On July 2nd, the rover's mast-mounted stereo camera tilted up to the sky above Durazo Crater and photographed a deep black dot on the solar disk seen here. Perseverance does this all the time. Using a solar filter, the rover looks at the sun almost every day to check its brightness. When the sun dims, researchers know a dust storm is brewing, one of the most important forms of weather on the red planet. Sunspots are just a bonus. A recent study shows that Perseverance sees more than 40% of all sunspots, despite the fact that Mars is 78 million kilometers further from the sun than Earth, and the rover's camera doesn't put many pixels across the solar disk. So you're looking at actual photography from the quote-unquote backside of the sun. This is July 2nd, July 3rd, and July 4th. That's what they're telling us. The article continues, Perseverance has one big advantage. It can see parts of the sun we cannot. From where Mars is currently located, Perseverance views more than half of the sun's far side, giving it a preview of sunspots still hidden from Earth. That's how the rover spotted AR-3363 days in advance. People on Earth first saw the sunspot on July 5th, 2023. A very big sunspot indeed which has now made it around the limb and is in play. This is the same sunspot that NASA says was so large was making the sun wobble. I believe we've only heard that from NASA one or two other times over the last decade. Earth's actual size has been installed or inputted into this photograph so you can see the size of sunspot AR3363 absolutely enormous and i will check that sunspot's magnetic configuration right now which turns out to be very uncomplex at this time with only a one percent chance of x flare for today although it just hurled out a c flare this moment as we know we're heading into an area of our solar system that's going to generate lots of magnetic connections between the planets and the alignment of planets. So let's watch out for the next 120 days. It should be epic. Share, subscribe, always remember anything's possible in Bizarro World.